Okay, friends, I just signed off on that first project, but guess what? I have a bonus project for you. This is an alternative to the snowman head being on the candlesticks. Look how quick and easy you can have another gift or uh, another piece, a decorative piece for the holidays. Very simple and inexpensive to make. Okay, in the previous video, I showed you how I took two candlesticks and I glued them together with E6000 and I let them set overnight. And when they were dry in the morning, I uh, went ahead and spray painted it with Rust-Oleum black chalk paint. And I'm really loving that chalk paint. All right, for this project, you're gonna need the candlesticks, a uh, Maj Paj, a brush, Prisma Glitter, you're gonna need your little votive. And if you can't find one at the Dollar Tree, let me tell you, I had to use a wine glass as an alternative. But uh, this weekend, I was able to find one. You're gonna need fake snow and Epsom salt. And friends, look what I found at Walmart. They have all these little signs, these little packages that uh, have all kinds of fun stuff that you can add to your projects. So today I'm gonna be using the one that says uh, Believe, just like that one. Oh, let it snow. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> I did say that when you tune into my craft channel, expect the unexpected. <laughs> All right, let's see, what else am I gonna need? The glue gun, and look, friends, those little um, hot pads that I got at the Dollar Tree are great to set your hot glue on. You're gonna need to paint to catch some of the Epsom salt when we put it on our craft project. Real simple, easy to make. All right, you're also gonna need a pick that you can steal some of the greenery off of. So let's get started. I think that's all. And ribbon. And a little bit of chenille stick to uh, tie your bow up with. And scissors. All right, we're ready. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take the um, votive cup here and open up my jar of Maj Paj. And I'm using this um, wider nylon brush. I found that it works real good to spread a thick layer, not to where it's dripping, but just thick. And I just kind of went around it. Not necessarily too much ways, but for it to look like snow. And I just went all the way to the rim of it. Make sure you get it, get it on there pretty good. Like I said, thick enough to have it on there, but not to where it's dripping off. Okay, when you think you've got enough on there, that it's well covered, you get your Epsom salt. And I just start going to town with it. Try to get it all covered. And then I just kind of tap it down a little bit. Okay, shake it off a little bit and then get your Prisma glitter and just shake it all over it. And see, you can already see it's starting to shine. And it's not even dry yet. All right, when you think you've got enough in, on it, just set it aside. Now we can start working on the base here. I'm gonna go ahead and, and put my bow on here. I'm gonna start with a strip, just one strip of ribbon, and it's got the wires at wiring in the ends, it's a wired ribbon. I'm just gonna take the end of this brush and kind of curl it a little bit. I'm 
I am going to clip the ends into little dovetails. I'm just going to make a quick bow, fast and simple. I just loop it. I did learn how to make a funky bow and I'll be showing you how I made it when um, I put my wreath together. Okay, I think that's good enough. Just going to pinch it all together here. Grab my little chenille stick there, pipe cleaner. Twist it off. I'm going to make the dovetails on this too as well. See, it makes a nice little bow. And um, I'm going to go ahead and use the little ribbon that it has. and take it around the back. Add some glue. Turn this around for a minute. Hold it for a little bit until it sets. Okay, I think it's set now. All right, I'm not going to mess with it for, for a minute. I'm going to go ahead and use, from this pick, I'm going to take the little pine cone and a couple of these shiny little leaves here. In fact, this little piece right here will do. This is so much fun and so fast and easy to do. Okay, I think I'm going to place that right there. Going to get some glue. Put that on there. Gonna get some glue on my pine cone. I'm about to run out of glue gun. Glue on my glue gun here. Luckily I'm almost done. And I'll stick a little berry on there as well. A little frosted berry. Oh my goodness, now I already have a glass that is ready that I did earlier and I'm going to go ahead and use it. This was a wine glass because I couldn't find this particular little votive and it worked out perfect and it is from the Dollar Tree as well. And it's going to set right in there. I'm going to use some of that... Um, I'm not going to use hot glue. Whew, what did I do with my glue? Give me a minute. 
Okay, friends, I'm going, normally I would use E6000, but I'm out of it, okay? So I'm gonna use this Fix All Adhesive from Dollar Tree. And I'll let you know how good it works. But anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and put glue all around the base. Now you just set it on top. How about there? Does that look better? All right, now I'm going to put some fake snow, and this is from the Dollar Tree as well. find that my wine glass takes up more snow <laughs> than the little votive. Oh yes. Friends, it doesn't get any easier than this. Look at that, is that not adorable? And this candle is an LED little uh, $1 candle from the Dollar Tree. And look how beautiful that looks. If somebody gave me this as a, as a gift, I would be so appreciative. So make some for your friends and family. Okay, folks, next time I'll be working on some more crafts to share with you. Uh, but for now, this is it. This is my little bonus project for y'all. Uh, today is a good day to smile and be happy.